going to be covering three aspects of sex. So we'll do a general introduction, sex notation, and then we'll look at ways of describing sex. So in our daily life, we talk about various ways of describing sex. We talk about a group of students, a collection of flowers, and a team of players. These are all various ways of describing sex. So let's look at these two examples. So we can have team of players. angry students. So let's call this A and B. So from these two examples, team of players, when we talk of team of players, we can identify all the members that form the team that are playing a specific team. Looking at example B, angry students, if we look at angry students, Kofi might see Amma to be angry, but then Kwame will see Amma not to be angry. So in, with these two examples, we can see that a team of players is clearly defining a collection of players playing a specific team. But in angry students, we can't really tell which group of students fall under angry students. So in this case, we can say that example A qualifies to be a set, but in example B does not qualify to be a set. So in this case, we can clearly define sets as a well-defined collection of objects. So let's go back to A and B. So we can see that team of players is well-defined and it's a collection of players. So that fits our definition perfectly. So let's take these examples and see if we can identify if they are sets or not. So So can you identify which of these three examples qualify to be a set. I believe you were able to identify which of these qualify to be a set. So a class of students qualifies to be a set because when we walk into a class we can clearly identify which group of students qualifies to be under that class boys in jhs2 in my school if you come to you come to my school you, you can clearly identify the boys that are in jhs2 in my school but then happy people in ghana cannot qualify to be a set based on our definition a well-defined collection of objects because we don't have any explained criteria or a set of rules for describing which people will be qualified to be happy people in Ghana. So, therefore, one, two qualifies to be a sex, but three, that's not.